Okay, hi everybody, it's me, Falcon Two. Um, Bongo Stray Dogs, season four, episode three. So, <clears throat> without going too much details, this is essentially the last video uh, uh, episode that we are in the past. Um, this one was called the founding of the detective agency. That's what this was. Um, so as we saw from last week, Ron Paul, um, was separated from Fukukawa. He went into the car with that cop. By the way, he's not a cop. Okay. <laughs> um, it's kind of interesting. The beginning of the episode, I found it interesting because it was like, you know, I, I like Ron Paul. He he's just like the greatest detective, you know. You know, he knows what's going on. Sees everything. And he's going back and forth with this, this cop who's not a cop <laughs> in the car. And, you know, as the as they do this conversation thoroughly, you begin to realize that Ron Paul knows what's going on here. And he's like, okay, at the end, he's like, okay, won't you tell me really where we're going? So, essentially, what occurs during this situation is he's getting taken to this kind of warehouse. And we'll, we'll, get, we'll get into what, what Fukawa does, but he goes to this warehouse with the cop, who's not a cop. They're an organization that takes gifted. Kills them or something, because they they the higher ups who orchestrated this thing at that at that play with the murder and everything. They're very upset because of what Rompo did. He basically saw saw the whole murder. Da 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 da. It was all ruined. <laughs> so they're upset by it, and they wanted this guy who was pretending to be a cop to kill him. That was basically the gists of the majority of the episode. Um. Fukawa, saying his name right, probably wrong. He finds out that the cop, I forgot his name, sorry, is the one who did the murders, did the murder. And the guy with the cane has some significance. So, you know, it was funny also seeing Ron Paul, what, he, how, what exactly this guy did. He took a piece of the carpet in the auditory hallway to wrap the guy up in because it has this residue of something called organic solvent that if you put if you inhale it you pass out go figure but basically what what transpires is it was funny too Rambo is not interested in what this guy is selling and he's like moo <laughs> Sorry, he starts booing like a cow because he says he's boring and not interesting. <laughs> I was dying when I was seeing that shit. I was like, what the hell? But logistically speaking, what occurs is he counts down to like, he says, oh, you got three seconds. And here comes Fukawa Kakaza. I can't say that guy's name. Like, Wreck shit up. Oh my God. This was a great freaking action scene. Completely crazy. Martial arts all the way. Knocking guys out. Oh, man. It was a great action sequence. But that happens. And they, they stop the guy. Now, we get the ending scene. Where it's Rampo and, you know, Fukawa. He, they're in, like, the, um... They're outside. And they find out, he reads in the paper that the, um... Oh, yeah, there was also a scene where Rumpel cries. Yes, he apologizes because he was, you know, caught and was going to die and whatnot. Uh, <clears throat> looking at the paper to find out the guy who was trained to be the cop was killed. He was silenced. But in the rooftops, we see this dude saying, it's not V, it's five. It's like a kind of boating. But... The, the episode I thought was interesting, I can see now this is how it was the origins of the detective agency. 
But the the real nitbits is when they show the end credit scene. There was an end credit scene in this episode. They meet Natsume, who is the guy. Confidentially, I would say the guy who helped make the detective agency. Because what happens is Ron Poe and what's his face? Go to see him, and they say to him that he's the only one who can help them because he knows how to get, um, like, a, it's some kind of certificate or grant to it that allow you to have a facility, a business with gifted, with, gift, with a gifted. So this is basically the detective agency, how it was created. Now, that that's basically the origin. The origin really was Ron Poe and... The president, whose name I can't say. <laughs> um, and that was basically what, what transpired. So not so he basically gets him the the grant, the 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 per well, no permit, that's what it was, permit. The permit to have this, and that's basically what transpired there. And at the end of the episode we get a, a preview for next week, and it says going back to the present. And the, the next episode has to do with some kind of murder. So we're probably gonna see everybody else from season three. Now, now that we had three episodes, but did this these three episodes I think does tell a story. Because if you've seen the trailers, you know that in the new season of season four for stray dogs, they are stray dogs and they get hunted, supposedly. So I guess that has something to do why they decided to show the origin story. You know, it it, it brings some focus. To the show. Um, but I thought it was a good episode. Um, I, the action sequences were pretty awesome. Um, you know, we'll see what happens next week. We're going back to the present. Back in time. No. Anyway, so that that's basically what happened. I, probably, I, I would say I'd give this a 9 out of 10. I, I thought the action sequences were pretty freaking awesome. Rompo Man, oh, it was so good. It was so good. Towing this, they're basically towing, he was basically toying with this guy. Like, like he's saying, oh, you know, oh, no, I, I know what's going on. I thought it was pretty awesome how he, he you know, laid all that, laid that all out. But, um, yeah, good episode all around. I should let everyone know, um, tomorrow night, my first first impressions. This one's going to be Tomo-chan is in love. Oh, no, no, is in, is a girl. I said it. <laughs> I don't know why I said that. But that one is going to come tomorrow. First impressions on that. Um, I am I think I mentioned this. I'm not sure if I mentioned this. I'm adding an anime to the list. <clears throat> There's this isekai. <laughs> I am not joking around when I say this. I know I'm breaking a rule here. Doing another isekai. For first impressions. It is about a dude. Whose skill is. Online grocery. Buying groceries. Online. But. The show is so ridiculous. I, I, I gotta. But another video. Not, not this week. Not, not, not until, probably next week is going to happen. Next week I'm going to do that video next week. It's it's oh, it's gonna be really good. But this is Bob Connors with another episode of Stray Dogs. We're going back to the present next week. We get to see all those guys. Another thing three. I'll see you guys later. Peace.